Alluvium is a Web3 game where you can earn real money. Understanding these crypto terms will help you navigate the play-to-earn gaming world. I'll lay down the foundation with general crypto terms, followed by some crypto gaming terms, and then I'll get into terms specifically relating to the game of Alluvium. Feel free to skip over the first section if you have a good understanding for crypto, but watching might help you clear up any uncertainties you might have. My name is Najif, and I'm a professional ranger. Like all of you, I crash landed here in Alluvium with nothing. Join me on my journey as I capture and train alluvials as I battle my way to the top. You're watching Najaf Plays Journey Through Alluvium. Strap in, I'm gonna move fast. So crypto or cryptocurrency, a form of digital asset based on a network that is distributed across a large number of computers, making it decentralized. Bitcoin, the first crypto asset, was created by Satoshi Nakamoto in January of 2009. Blockchain, a decentralized network in which crypto is built on that creates a permanent record or ledger of all transactions. Altcoin, which is short for alternative coins. This encompasses all crypto coins that are not Bitcoin. DEX, this stands for a decentralized exchange. And this is where peer-to-peer -peer crypto transactions can be made. Ethereum, a layer one platform powered by blockchain technology. This is the largest altcoin by market cap. Smart contracts. Simple programs stored on the blockchain that run when predetermined conditions are met. NFT. This is a non-fungible token. These are one-to-one -to -one tokens typically pegged to an asset such as an image, song, or in-game item. DeFi. Decentralized finance. Financial applications built on the blockchain that enable peer-to-peer -peer transactions without the need of paperwork or a third party such as a bank. Staking, the process of locking up your crypto assets in order to obtain a reward or earn interest. Liquidity pool, a pot of crypto assets locked within a smart contract that provide liquidity for exchanges or other financial applications. Burning, sending of crypto assets to a wallet in which nobody has the private key. This removes that crypto asset from circulation forever. DAO, a decentralized autonomous organization, an entity with no centralized leadership, governed by a community with rules enforced through smart contracts. GameFi, or gaming finance, the marriage between gaming and DeFi. These games allow for true ownership of in-game assets combined with play-to-earn mechanics. Play and earn, also known as play-to-earn, mechanics in a game that allow you to earn cryptocurrency through playing. Scholarships. Gamers who utilize other people's in-game assets in order to earn cryptocurrency. Splitting the earnings between the owner of the assets and the player. A manager. A person who lends out their in-game assets for others to play with. Splitting the earnings between the two parties. Alluvium. A game built on the blockchain that makes use of NFTs and DeFi. It's also a DAO. ILV. It's an ERC-20 token that's built on Ethereum. It has three functions. Governance liquidity mining, and revenue distribution, SILV, or soon to be SILV2, a synthetic ILV token used as an in-game currency. It's pegged to the ILV price in-game, and it can be earned by staking ILV. Use of this coin will burn the underlying ILV token. Revdis, or revenue distribution. All ETH spent on the game will be used to buy back the ILV token, which will be distributed back to the ILV stakers. IIP, an alluvium improvement proposal. Proposals can be submitted to the DAO, and the best ones will be voted on through governance. Illuvidex, the Illuvium Exchange, an online marketplace for players to buy and sell in-game NFTs from each other. Illuvials, Pokemon-like creatures you will be able to catch and play with in the Illuvium game. These will be NFTs. The Ranger, this is the in-game player character, which is not an NFT. Illuvatars, a modular, configurable, NFT-based system for getting an avatar into the Illuvium universe. Alluvium Zero, a mobile minigame of Alluvium. It's a base building game staged on a plot of land. It will interact with the main game by producing fuel and other resources. Fusing, the mechanism used to evolve alluvials. Three of the same alluvials will need to be fused and therefore burned to create an NFT of its evolved form. Affinities, elements of the Alluvium world. Affinities can be a single element or a combination of two. They include water, earth, fire, nature, and air. Classes. Alluvials are grouped into five base classes. They can have a single class or a combination of two. The five base classes are Fighter, Bulwark, Rogue, Scion, and Empath. Synergies. During battle, alluvials will get bonuses from other alluvials of the same affinity and class. 
Shards. Shards are used to catch alluvials. Shards can be cured from farming of in-game resources or purchased off the market. There are actually quite a few more terms than I have in this video, but I tried to limit it as much as I can to the important things. Make sure not to FOMO into anything, and always DYOR before you decide to hodl something. But that's it for me. I hope this convinces you to subscribe to my channel and join me in my journey through Alluvium. Make sure you click that subscribe button and check out this video I've highlighted here if you haven't seen it already. I highly recommend it. I'm also on Instagram, posting more content about Alluvium, Fancy Birds, Axie Infinity, and more. So go give that a follow. You can find all these links below, including my Linktree link. If you're interested in Drip or just another way you can support the channel, then use my link to join my downline. Thanks again.